Well, last week when we were at the house with the green parrot, we told the boys and girls that we would be back to have a special Christmas party this week, and all the boys and girls were very happy. We took a lot of people from Sobrajinho to help. It's a long way to get there, and we had to take two cars with all the people. I drove the big car, and Papa took the little yellow car. A couple of people rode with him. They had to wear motorcycle helmets so the bugs don't hit them in the face while they're driving. After we got to the place, oh, look at that. There's the goats on the side of the hill. I like to see them. After we got there, we sat down for a few minutes and talked to the people about where we should have our special celebration. And then we separated to call all the kids that live in Abrels to come to our special party. Papa had found a place with a big porch so we would have lots of shade. And we took lots of cardboard and carpets and things for the kids to sit on. We started out talking about a special Bible verse, Romans 3.23, and Papa did a magic trick where he makes a cloth disappear and talks about how God makes our sin disappear. Then we talked about the five colors of the wordless book. Gold, talks about God is holy. Black, that talks about people have sin. Bruno did that part. He did a good job. Then we had red, that talks about the blood of Jesus that forgives us of our sins. Some of the boys and girls weren't listening very good, but Claudinia did her best. And then Sophia, she told all about white and how we need to ask God for forgiveness of our sins so he'll make our heart clean. And then Maria Luisa jumped up to talk about new life in Jesus. That's for the color green. I tried to tell a little story, but well, it was kind of crazy and all the boys and girls were getting a little bit tired and their mothers too. And boy, was it hot. It was so hot, I was sweating. Then we had all the boys and girls line up to get their special prize. Every boy and girl got a cup with the colors from the wordless book, full of candy and popcorn and treats. And they also got a little Christmas cake a special Christmas cake called a Pony Tony, and it had chocolate chips in it. Here's my favorite little girl, get hers. And all the boys and girls lined up according to age. First the little ones, and then the big ones. Some people were fighting a little bit, and some of the big boys weren't sure if they wanted our special cup, but everybody was mostly happy, even this girl that got both of her things and stood there to get a picture taken. Afterwards, all the silly people from Sobrajinho took lots of pictures with all the little boys and girls. And then we got ready to tell everybody goodbye. We had about 75 boys and girls. It was a lot. And quite a few mothers too. We told everybody Merry Christmas. And then we got back in the car and came back to Sobrajinho, hot and tired and very sweaty. We had a good day, and I hope they did too. Some of those boys and girls may not get very much for Christmas, but at least they got to hear about Jesus and his special story, the present of God who was born on Christmas Day, and they got some presents. That's the end of my video letter for today. I want to wish you a wonderful Christmas. And don't forget, nois chi amamos.